Hello, my beautiful fountain friends. Welcome to Creepy Nibs. I'm Count Chocula. Today, we will be demonstrating ecstasy at terrific happy stationery with a bunch of ink that uh, I received today from Venice. I have two bottles. I have eight samples. So we should probably get a move on or we're going to be here all night. I mean, we will, just not with this episode. Ugh! I think it's cool that I already have a series that already has with me in the title so that I can be cool and have the hashtag in my video title. So yay, yay, there's that. Stay at home. So first, Twisby Black. I am very excited for this. Shit, oh, I wasn't going to put a sticker on this one. Let me just wear here. Here's a single one on a piece. And we'll just, we'll just do that because I want to crack this open it. Go! Oh shit! Okay, okay, we're good. I love this bottle, by the way. This frosted glass. Shape's really nice. Oh, it's just... Oh, it's gorgeous. I love it. It's, I love it. 70 milliliters for only sixteen ninety nine. Pretty good deal. And if Amanda's videos aren't lying to me, this should be a really good black. Oh, big dip. Whatever. Okay. Okay. Okay, yes. Ooh. It's got some green undertones, it seems. See, can we get a look at that? Little bit. Little bit. Cool. Happy times and fun stuff is here. Um, this bottle also comes with one of these that you can put in the bottle if you want to. So like when it gets really low and it's hard to fill, you can stick this in there and then do the whole same thing with the- Whoa! 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 That's rad. Good job, Twisby. A plus on your ink bottles. Now can we get the pink in a size like this? That would be fucking amazing. Cool. Next. Raw und Klingner Sketch Ink. This is Thea, which is the gray. Uh, I don't have a waterproof gray yet. <clears throat> I tried Lexington gray for noodlers a long time ago. I did not. Whoa. Whoa. That looks like weird. It's all like opaque. Can you see that? No. No, that that's impossible to photograph. Um, but we're going to try it out anyway. That is a gorgeous gray. Yes. 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 I approve this message. It looks gross before it dries, but once it does, that it's fab. Very excited for that. Hope it doesn't do bad, shitty performance things. Okay, uh, we can move these out of the way. They're not ready yet. God damn it, get in my hand. Okay, cool. Happy times. Um, so these three, I know what they are. These five, I don't. And instead of reading them before I put the, the ink on the, the sticker, I'm just gonna put the ink on the sticker and then read it after. This one right here is Stipula Dark Grey. Looked really pretty. Let's do a little bit of that. And it is. Oh, that's very pretty. I would not call this dark grey though. <laughs> Maybe there, yeah, but you do the one. Uh, that's not. Maybe this is going to be an incredible shader. We don't know yet. Here's another gray. This is Robert Oster Australian Opal Gray. I'm very excited for this. I love opals. They're like my favorite rock. Because they're so pretty. And my birthstone. Yay. Ooh. Hmm. 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 I'm not really a fan of grays that lean blue, to be honest. <clears throat> but maybe this one will be better. 
like a nib, or it kind of looks like it has some depth to it. Oh, that's not photographing properly. Oopsie daisy. Sorry for that. And then Aurora Gray, which I am so pumped to do. Amanda B also got a sample of this recently. And I tried to help myself, like, stop myself from looking at the swatch she did so I could be surprised, but I ended up doing it anyway. Oh my gourd. That is gorgeous. Yes. Queen. Queen. Yes. Cool. So that's those. Scooters over here. Now we have a number one. Let's see, oh, it looks like a green. Maybe? Is it? Whoa, exposure, calm yourself. Oh, I see, I saw a bit of the brand name. Ooh. Ooh, that's pretty. Oh, wait, did I order this one on purpose? No, I couldn't have. Impossible. So cool. It's a is gray. Which one is it? Mouse gray. Cute. Mouse are adorable. Mouse, mice. Uh, next. We, oh, oh, poop. Ah, all right, there we go. Ink number two, which is a purple or a gray. I don't know. Maybe they just gave me a bunch of grays because they knew that I ordered a bunch of grays. I'm like, hey, let's give them some grays. It's fine. Yeah, it's another fucking gray. This is rad. I am pleased about this. It's very like, I don't know, kind of blue, kind of green. It's like a, it's like a gray with teal undertones. That's really neat. What are you? Tell me your secret. Papia plume oyster gray. Nice. And. What are you? Whoa, get off. Oh, that is gorgeous. That is... Hmm. Are you what I think you are? You look a lot like Aroshizuku Kirisame. Maybe, okay, maybe not. Maybe not. It is, okay. Wow, good. good. I, I didn't, I can't believe I did that. Oh, I've always wanted to be able to like guess in ink. Ah! Attack of the 50 foot tripod. Um, but yes, ooh, I, I, I saw this one. I'm a bad person. So I don't need to do card of this. We could put this over here. I have a pen friend I can send that to because she doesn't have it yet. This is an orange. Orange. Whoa! That is not what that looks like in person. My bad. There, that's a little bit better. This is very orange. They keep sending me fucking oranges. It's like, no, you need a little bit of brightness in your life. But that looks cool with all these grays. That's pretty cool. Oh, I am so excited to do this swatch video. This is going to be awesome. And last. Eh, get over here. Is this another fucking gray? Oh my god. Yes! Yes. Yes! Ooh, what are you? Three oysters, cool gray. It is a cool gray. So neat, neat, neat. Those are today's samples. So there's not gonna be 10, there's gonna be nine. It's fine, I'm not upset about it. If I had not had Kirisame already, I was Kirisame already, I would be like shitting my pants that I got that ink because it's gorgeous. Okay, so. Let's get a move on, shall we? Holy fuck, 10 minutes! Whatever, you guys like these long videos. I don't know why I'm freaking out about it. Yeah. 
Ooh, where's my shit? Where's my shit? There it is. Got it. Fine, we're fine. It's fine. Whew. I gotta get a taper powell ready. Oh, that shadow's gonna be a dick. I got this a little better. This is a nice wide mouth. Don't we love a nice wide mouth? Oh, yeah. I almost put that in my drink. <laughs> Good job, you dumbass. All right. Nice dip. Let's skip that a little bit. I wrote the name down too low. Fight me. Yo. Holy shit. I mean, we'll have to see it after it dries, but that is just a pit of inky darkness. My goth heart cannot. Whoa. 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 I... <sighs> wow. That is just... Gorgeous. That is gorgeous. It's so dark. That's so dark. Can't that the way it looks on camera right now is exactly what it looks like in person. Just like there's a giant hole in the middle of my desk. Yes. Yes. I love it when I can like just cut, buy a bottle without buying a sample and then the bottle is just amazing. So cool you go Twisby. I applaud you on this one. Ooh, in the water, it turned, like, orange. It's like a, like a bit of brown. Cleaned out of the brush almost instantly. That is good. That is very good. Hallelujah. Oop, I gotta move this stuff so I have a drying space. Do, 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 do. Holy crap. Look out, Graphon Fabric has still carbon black. Bitch is coming for your crown. Okay. Oh, I should have grabbed a piece of blotting paper, but whatever. It's fine. I don't care now. Um, Alrighty then. Good enough. And of course, my neighbors decide now is the best time to blast a tremendous amount of bass heavy music that I can feel in my walls. It's not like they're shaking, but like I can feel it. You know what I mean? But you know, whatever. It's their house. They're not doing anything horribly wrong. And I'm not trying to sleep right now, so I'm not too mad about it. But when they do it in the afternoon, when I am trying to sleep, oh my god, it's like, why? I'm not going to go over and be like, hey, can you turn that down? Because that's total party pooper. And I don't want to be a bumtastic bummer. <clears throat> And they're probably jamming. They're having a good time. I don't want to interrupt that. Definitely not calling the cops. I will never call the cops for any reason whatsoever. I don't care if I'm in the middle of being murdered. Just no. Not doing it. Not doing it. Ooh. This kind of turned the bristles yellow. 
This is amazing though. Look at that complexity while it's drying. Yo. Let's get up focus. Can we? Yeah. Look at that. There's some gold in there. Like that part. Cool. We'll have to see it more once it's dry. But this is an awesome, awesome time. Okay, next. We're just gonna, we'll do the orange first. Bung box fresh mandarin orange. I'm pretty sure you won't be able to hear that, so I'm not gonna say anything more about that. Whoa, this one's like a bunch of feet. <laughs> Where's my pen? There, found it. Whoa! Good thing the cap was on. That would have been bad. Okay. Boop. That's pretty. Whoa! Pretty orange. Pretty, pretty, pretty. Pretty, pretty. Pretty, 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 pretty. Pretty, 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 pretty. Ba, 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 ba. Oh, my mouth is very wet today. I don't know what's going on. Just drooling all over the place. Like some kind of hound that has rabies. I am Cujo. Whoa, this is really pretty. Patches, this one's for you. You see? You see? It's so bright. Like the light you shine into my life. You beautiful little kitty baby. Yes. Nice, aptly named, too. Like, this orange is like the color of an orange. Coolio. Yeah. 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 Oh, yeah. I love that. That looks so cool. Yes. Halloween, Halloween. It says Halloween, 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 Halloween. Halloween, Halloween, Halloween. All right. Next we will do... Ooh, I don't want to put it in the... Okay. Let's scoot it. Did I say this was a diatomentous mouth gray? Mouth gray? <laughs> My gray is mouth. What? I'm fine. It's fine. We're fine. Mouse gray is gray like a mouse, but not all mice are gray. To be inclusive of the mice, because all mice are beautiful in their own special way, and they're so cute. They're cute little faces, and they do this stuff. People think they're gross, but whatever. They're wrong. Mice are not gross. They are cute. They're good for your soul. 
Oh, shoot. I forgot to do more of those little dots up in the corner like I did there. Whatever. This is pretty. Yes. Very pretty. Ooh, definitely not quite that. That's better. That's better. Okay, I'm just going to keep the light like this the rest of the time, and then um, I won't have to bitch about the color being wrong. <clears throat> so there we go. That also means now I can't fix the first part. <laughs> Who cares? Who cares? You come for the pen stuff and stay for my endearing and charming personality. <sighs> Only like half kidding. <laughs> All right, papier plume, oyster gray. Never tried a papier plume before. Well, no, that's fine. That brush is just gone forever. <laughs> it's nice knowing you. <laughs> Why did I start it like in the middle? That stupid. I'm stupid. Zoom. I have a feeling this one might be a little bit dry. It's pretty though. Shoot. Maybe that light's more accurate. Whatever. I'm not gonna fuck with it. It's fine just the way it is. But that one's also got some complexity in it. You can see there's like blue around here lighter gray. I am so excited to see these when they're dry. I don't know which one of you packed this order, or like grabbed the samples, whatever it is. I don't know how the chain of command goes at Van Ness, but thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. This is like the kind of customer service that I live for. That's why they're my favorite pen people. There's Oh my god, they, I got black ink all over a bunch of stuff, and I don't know where it came from. Uh, I mean, it came from the bottle of Twisby Black, but, 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 next, Three Oysters Cool Gray. Cool Gray. I want to try Daldum really bad, but everywhere's out of stock. I don't know, everywhere, but a lot of places. Fairness is out of stock. Let's just... That's the real reason. Okay. I must have gotten one of the skinny parts of the glass nib. It happens. I like how I can. O I only have to use really one brush for all of these because there's not really going to be any color cross contamination because they're all gray. I got more black. Okay. Okay. Twisby black, starting to piss me off. What did I do to my brush? Oh, I'm a terrible person. I should feel bad. I don't really like cool grays. 
This is uh, that's not bad. That's not too bad. You are seeing it way more purple. That is not even close to being right. Okay. <laughs> I said I wasn't gonna fuck with the lighting. I fucked with the lighting. I'm a dishonest piece of shit. I will be eaten by hounds. Covered in bees. Me, not the hounds. Or the hounds. The hounds are covered in bees and they're eating me. That's pretty. Look at that stuff. Oh no! <laughs> it just landed face down. <laughs> oh, it's like making a peanut butter and fluff sandwich and you drop the half of the fluff and then you cry because you love fluff. It's strawberry fluff and you can't find that everywhere. You have to go all the way to the Christmas tree shops to get it and then. Anyway. Anyway. Next we'll do Robert Oster Australian Opal Grey. <laughs> Australia's got some, like, hella opals. I don't know what it is about Australia that makes them so prone to having opals. Especially pre Ooh, 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 look at that. We got sheen on Twispy Black, and I'm excited for it because it's pretty. I am feeling very musical today. Okay. Oh, I'm putting my hand in more ink because I'm a bastard. I mean, I am, but that's unrelated. Ooh. I don't know if you saw that. I saw that. Can I get a little bit more in there? I don't know why. I just want to add more. Yes, that is very pretty. I like it way better on the coloring than I do on the the lid. I do not need another bottle of ink. Whoa, wait, where did that come from? Is there like some yellow hidden deep within this brush? There is. Where did that come from? Whatever, it's fine, but look at that. Pretty. Mini chromatography. Okay. That is gorgeous. Stunning. I missed a fucking spike. I'm dumb. Okay. Uh, you can go there. Two more to go, and then we're done. Next, we'll do stipula dark gray. I don't think I've ever tried a stipula ink before either, so hooray for firsty firsts. I wonder if this might mean it'll be dry too. Don't know. We will have to see. Use this brush because I can. 
and it's there. Whoa. That's nice. Not dark. Why is this called dark gray? If this is their dark gray, I want to know what their light gray looks like because I bet it's sexy. Maybe it'll dry differently. I don't know. We'll have to see. I call this a medium gray. Real pretty, got some golden undertones in there. That's nice. You can see that. I know you can. You can. You can, I promise. There you go. Pretty, pretty. Last one. Not least one. Definitely not. Is the new Aurora Gray. Oh, there's a little bit of shit on this card. Okay. It's E-Y, right? That's the only way to spell it. Okay. Oh, that's a big dip. I just, I went to go flourish that, and then I just, my brain stopped working. So it's a bad flourish. Okay. Oh, I cannot wait. This is gonna be so pretty. Yo. Oh, it really just glides across the paper. That's really nice. And like, hold on, maybe I could show this to you. I dip and then I scrape it off the side. Look at that. Did you, that's interesting. I don't think I've seen that before. Oh my God, this is stunning. I need to not buy another bottle of ink. I need to not buy another bottle of ink. I need to not buy another bottle of ink. I need to not buy another. But this gray though. Oh, holy shit snacks. Wow. It is anyway, it is really similar to the stipula one. Here they are next to each other, except in the writing. I don't know if it's because the Aurora is a little bit wetter. Um, but they both have a very similar vibe going on in this watch. I love both of them. They are gorgeous. But I like the writing in the stipula better. It's a little bit warmer. And this is a little bit... I don't know. I don't... I can't really say it. Because... Hmm. The Aurora is just a lot wetter, it would seem. <clears throat> and the stipula, not so much. But, oh, they're both just beautiful, complex grays exactly my ballpark and I don't even play football so like exactly you know when I say it's in my ballpark you know it's a good thing okay so we'll scoot these let them finish drying up a little bit we'll take a peek at our two more piece of paper <laughs> that twisty bleep the twisby black and the roaring cleaner still hasn't dried. But look at that sheen. The twisby black. That's amazing. And it's super dark. Super nice dark inky black. I cannot wait to write with this. And um, apologize to Graphon Fabric Castle Carbon Black. So that the, the, see, alright. 
<clears throat> Excuse me. This, <laughs> this is why I don't do, like, number ratings for inks and stuff like that, because what if I rated the Faber-Castell a 10, and then this came along, and then this is a 10. And they can't both be 10s if I like this one better. It's just, I don't know, it seems very arbitrary, and I don't think I can form a standardized system of doing it. You know what I mean? I think you do. Um, I love this. This gray, that's really pretty. Nice and warm. Kind of complex. The bunk box mandarin orange. Gorgeous. It has red sheen. Unless that's just still super... Nope. That's dry. That is red sheen. That is red sheen in an orange. Yo! It, oh, it almost looks kind of pink when the light hits it a certain way. That's really cool. That's really cool. I like that quite a bit. Uh, let's see. I don't remember what these ones were. You probably do because you just watched me do it. Uh, I think this is the cool gray. Or is this one the cool gray? Hold on. This is the oyster gray from Papier Plume. It's pretty. Very blue, though. Not my bag. Uh, this is the cool gray from Three Oysters. Also pretty blue and not really my bag, but it's pretty. Uh, and then this one has to be Detrimentous Mouse Gray. Very pretty. I like that a lot. Then this one is the Australian Opal Gray. Oh, maybe it's over here. Here. There we go. Yeah, that's the Opal Gray. That's the Stipula. I think that hurts the Aurora. They both look very similar, but this is also the Stipula. That is beautiful. Yes, and that Sheen. Look at that sheen on Toys Be Black. I'm gonna shit my brains out and die. Uh, so cool. Cool. There's that. That is the thing. Okay. Let's get these. Whoa. Okay. Uh, just look at that. The whole thing is sheen now. <laughs> it's a really pretty color of sheen. It's like it kind of gold but not really I don't know how to describe that it's like a greeny gold copper browns thing pretty very pretty and here's the hair tear I don't know how to pronounce it oh it's getting stuff all over the everything it's a good thing this is I can wipe this off if I need to see there we go cool Cool. Very pretty. I like that stone there. Oh, let's zoom out. That would be a better idea. Okay. Next. Bung box. Fresh mandarin orange. Very pretty orange. Very pretty. There we go. Now you can see it best. You got that red sheen in the corner down there. I'm surprised it didn't sheen all over. But uh, I'm not disappointed that it didn't. That's the thing. Detriment is mouse gray. It's cute. It's cute. Like a mouse. Um, not really... Not really one I'd go for, though. But it's, I'm glad I have it so that I can do some, like, gray ink profiling. And, um, like, ink... What did you call it? Ink study. Because it's so fun to, like, compare all these different colors. And I have a lot of gray. Okay, and then... Oh, I can't remember which one I did after that. This is the oyster. Yeah, okay. Here's the Papier Plume Oyster Gray. Very blue. Very, very, very blue. Not my bag. Not my bag. Um, but it's got, like, teal undertones with the blue. Like a tealy blue. Uh, so that's pretty cool. Uh, it does have a little bit of complexity in it. Not super interesting, though. Uh, and then here's three oysters cool gray. It's not quite as... I don't know, obviously blue as oyster gray. Or obviously teal, whatever. Um, but it's, it's nice. Again, not one I'd go for. But you might. You might see this and be like, whoa, that is awesome, and I'm going to get myself some. And you do it. You do it, because you deserve it. 
<sighs> okay, okay, next, next. Get over here, my beautiful baby. Here we have Robert Oster, Australi Australian Opal Grey, and that's, I have no idea what's going on there, but it's like... <laughs> I don't know why, I just rush out something weird into it. <laughs> I'm not going to tell you what it is. You can decide for yourself what you think, but it's very pretty. Oh, there's Sheen. There's Sheen there. There's Sheen. Sheen. Cool. Cool. Not cool. I mean, kind of cool. It's on the neutral side. Uh, and here's Stipula Dark Gray. Beautiful. I love it. And then Aurora Gray. So my favorites of this bunch... Probably the Stipula and the Twisby. Those are my two faves. My favorite gray, definitely the Stipula. Aurora's really good too, though. Um, I'm not... I have no complaints about those at all. So really, there's only two out of the five... Out of the, the ten. Nine. Jesus Christ. Well, I mean, out of the... Two out of the ten. I guess we're including Kirisame, because why not? Uh, that I wouldn't write with. But I would write with all the rest of these without even like having to do it. Like, I need to make an ink review and I'm gonna do this color, so I'm gonna write with this ink. And then, no, just normal everyday Count Chocula scribbly doodle in, in his own notebook. That's, that's, that's a thing. So here we go. I had fun. I hope you had fun. That was fun. Twisby Black is amazing. I cannot wait to write with it. Sketching. They, uh, Really cool, happy to have a completely waterproof gray. Uh, I don't know what else to say, so have a good day, Punch Nazis. I love you, bye!